This is Andy Pearl of Boxing Social in association with Bet Fred. I'm delighted to be by Terry Thompson, father to Cal Brook on the back of his victory against Amir Khan tonight. Terry, congratulations to you and the team. What did you make of your son's performance and his win tonight? I thought his, his performance were, were, were clinical. You know, he executed it absolutely, you know, perfectly. I think he did a, a wonderful job, you know, but he has put a hell of a lot, you know, into this camp. You know, he's, he's obviously made sure that that he got the win and I've always said along you know I said if Amir could beat that Kel Brook, you know I'd be first to go and shake his hand and say that you know is something else you know what was your thoughts as the rounds were progressing it was a strong start for both I think you know speaking to people around me I maybe had Amir winning one of the six rounds what did you make of it I, I, I don't know whether I looked through those coloured glasses at times you know sometimes it's you know, if it's your son, it's sometimes hard to see the other opponent's success. You know, I know there were, I did at times, you know, see Cal's head, you know, fly back and think, oh, he's got him or he's rumbled him or they were kind of stumbled. Yeah, I, I can probably, looking back at it, can see, you know, where you're coming from. Uh, yeah, I would say, you know, he had that, that success in there a bit, you know, and he had it a bit as far as I, looking through my glasses. From what you saw of your son tonight, Terry, how much more does he have to give to the sport? Would you be happy to see him return to the ring or would you rather see him walk away on a victory such as that to end what was such a, a, had become a bitter rivalry? I would say that that is absolutely, totally, you know, Kel's choice because in this, like you said, they, they, they've had a long career. I mean, it seems like forever since we started back in that gym, you know, sort of seven year old. You know, that were what, nearly three decades ago, you know, so at what point do you, do you carry on? You know, that, that's entirely up to Kelly either. I mean, I know I know that he's loved this camp, he's enjoyed it because he's had something, you know, good to train for. Is there another Amir out there with that sort of story? No, I don't think there is, you know, so it's, it's what Kel feels. I mean, if you, I, I don't know, I really don't know, you know, it, it really is, is up to Kel. That atmosphere tonight, Terry, was unbelievable. But just for Carl's ring walk, you know, both guys had fans in there, but Carl's ring walk, there was a, quite a loud chorus of boos. What did you make of just that entire atmosphere? And obviously, at the end of the night, we saw those boos ch change to, to cheers. To be honest, with you, what an atmosphere. You know, what a, what a great crowd. You know, I, I'd got sort of mixed feelings, uh, all sorts of... I don't know what I would imagine. This were a fight, to be honest, we are like... Bigger than any world title fight, it had, it had some, just had a, had a feel about it. It had, to, it had an aura, you know. It, I, I can't put it to words. It was a magical, magical event, you know, tonight. And I, I really do thank the fans, you know, for all, all being brilliant, you know. All everybody got on, you know. It was a beautiful atmosphere, you know. So glad that none of the boxers got, a, you know, in there, and everybody's safe, you know. That that's the ultimate, ultimate. Ultimate goal for me, how, how everything you know ended. It was such a beautiful night. How are you celebrating tonight? Just gonna go home and have a sleep, to be fair. <laughs> you know, you're not one of them with the adrenaline that's gonna keep you up. Oh, could you imagine going out? Uh, <laughs> I was need a sleep. <laughs> Listen, Terry, whatever you do going, going to do tonight, I hope you all have a good one. Thank you for speaking to me in Boxing Social. Right, th thank you. <laughs>